Today I'm take a look at the Vivor Multi-Tool. So it comes with a carrying pouch. Looks like we got a spot where we can put that on the belt loop. Oh, that's nice. So here we have got all the drive bits on this kind of flexible little holder. I also like that they put that in a separate pocket because most of the time when they give you these things, they just put it in the same pocket as the multi-tool. So the fact they got that separated is actually pretty nice. So we got five hex sockets, we got three flatheads, so we got three Phillips, and then we have an adapter. So that'll turn a square drive into a hex drive so that we can load these in. That does hold it very well. And there is the multi-tool. So it does have a clip on it, so we can clip that directly onto our jeans. Okay, so this does actually have a spring on it. The reason I like that is because on most of them you have to close it and then you have to open it manually. With this one, there's gonna be a lot less fatigue on your hands if you have to use this all day. I also like seeing that the blades on here are actually replaceable. For most of these multi-tools, once this blade wears out, you basically just have to throw the whole thing away. So I really like that they did that. And they got kind of a clever thing here. So when you close it up, it's not entirely closed. When you press it down, then it locks in. Very neat. So on the inside of the handles, we got a hook, a bottle opener, a can opener. We got two more flatheads and all of these actually lock. So there's a button right here. You press that and this will close. But otherwise it is locked in place. And that works for all three of these. On the other side, we got a fishing blade and we got a Phillips, but this is where our square drive is. So if we want to use one of these bits, it will just slide right onto there. So we can close this guy up and use that like a big Phillips driver. So the thing I'm liking about this most right now is that this is actually fairly comfortable to hold. A lot of the times with these multi-tools, they have things sticking out here and they pinch your hands if you really need to get a good squeeze on it. With this, I could use this and I could squeeze the heck out of it and that wouldn't be an issue. So for the outside, this is nice. We got some safety scissors, so it's kind of rounded off there on the point. So that way, if you have to like pull a bandage off or anything like that, you don't have to worry about cutting anybody. We've got a saw. Very nice looking teeth on there. This is actually neat. This actually locks in as well. So there's another latch right here. Just press that in and we can fold it in. So that's good. On the other side, we got a file. So there's a file on the side as well as on the top. Now on the other side, we got some measurements. We got inches as well as metric. That also has a latch on it. And then the last one is the blade. And that is a very nice looking blade. And it comes plenty sharp. Again, this one also has a latch on it. Very cool. So overall, that is a very nice multi-tool.